This video is going to be about the excitation of chlorophyll by light. So chlorophyll is a photosynthetic pigment, which means that it's going to absorb light uh, in order to excite its electrons from the ground state to an excited state. So what that will look like is we'll have a photon of light come in. And with this photon, it needs to be um, exactly equal to the difference in energy between the ground state and the excited state of the electrons. So only photons that are that specific amount of energy will be able to be absorbed by the chlorophyll molecule, and that depends on the pigment itself, what uh, wavelength they absorb and what wavelength they reflect. So we'll absorb this photon, and when we do that, we're going to excite our electrons up to the excited state. So once these electrons are in the excited state, they can't stay there for very long because they're very high energy. So they're quickly going to drop back down to the ground state. And when they do that, they're going to release a photon of light as well as heat. So this understanding of uh, photons being used to excite electrons in photosynthetic pigments is really important, especially when we get into the photosystems and seeing how um, these electrons are passed from pigment, pigment to pigment and then ultimately um, excited to go on to the next photosystem. I hope you found this video really helpful. The concepts and information presented in these videos will be true regardless of what biology course you're taking. However, the material we covered in this video is specifically referencing material covered in Campbell Biology's 11th edition. Remember that if you are an enrolled Baylor student, we do offer free tutoring on the first floor of the Sid Richardson building, and you can schedule a free 30-minute appointment to have one-on-one -on -one tutoring online, or you can stop by during any of our business hours. For more information about the services we provide, you can go to our website at www.baylor.edu tutoring. Thank you.